In this video, let's see another numerical problem based on the concept of construction of a matrix when a rule is given related to the elements. In the previous video also we saw a related question. This question is also based on the same concept and the same methodology. Now the question is what? The question is construct a 2 by 2 matrix. So first of all note what is the order. The order is what? It is a 2 by 2 matrix. So that means in all we will having be 4 elements. 2 into 2 is 4. And the elements A, I, J are given to me. This is a CBAC previous year question. 1996 year it was asked. And the rule is A, I, J is equal to minus 3, I plus J upon 2 and a mod is given. That is why I have included this question. Most of you know what is the purpose of mod. In this question others will also come to know. Right. So let's get started by putting the heading as solution. And we will see what the question has to say, how to do it. I put the heading solution. So the question is what? It is A, I, J given to me in some form. The order is what? The order is 2 by 2. When the order is 2 by 2, let's draw a matrix with 2 rows, 2 columns. So it is C1, C2 columns, R1, R2 rows. Right? What is C1, R1 intersection? The element is named as A11. What is the intersection of R1 and C2? That means first row, second column. A12, here it would be A21, here it would be A22. This we already know by the previous videos. Now, simple and just put the values. I mean A11 means what? A11 means my I and J are both equal to 1. I need to find out. Aij means A11. That means wherever you have I, put 1. Wherever you have J, put 1. Minus 3 into 1. Minus 3 into 1 is minus 3. Plus J. Plus J. Plus J is plus 1. Whole mod upon 2. Simply putting the values. Now, what is minus 3 plus 1? That is minus 2. So, it is minus 2 modulus remains as it is and 2. Now you know what is the purpose of mod? The mod definition is something like this that if I have something called as mod x it would be split into two things minus x and x. Minus x when x is less than 0 and x when x is greater than equal to 0 that means every time you have a number this definition has to be followed. Now let's look at what is inside mod minus 2. That means minus 2 means minus less than 0 category, right? Minus 2 is less than 0. Minus 2 being less than 0 becomes minus x. So it becomes minus of minus 2. Again for those who have not understood. What is inside mod minus 2? That means a negative term. Negative means above or below above. So minus of x should be there. That means minus of minus 2 which is plus 2. So it becomes 2 upon 2 which is 1. What about after a11 we would be having a12. a12. That means i is 1, j is 2. i is 1, j is 2. Put in the formula or the rule given to me. Minus 3 into 1 is 1 into minus 3 minus 3 plus j plus 2 whole upon 2. Now what is minus 3 plus 2? Minus 3 plus 2 is minus 1. Minus 1 mod upon 2. Again, what is inside mod? Minus 1. What is minus 1 falling as less than 0? Minus x. That means minus of minus 1 which is plus 1. So it is 1 upon 2. Right? Next, after a11, a12. After a11, a12. I have a21, a22. Let me take a21 and then a22. a21 means i is 2, j is 1, minus 3 into i, minus 3 into 2 is minus 6, plus j is 1, mod whole upon 2. What is minus 6 plus 1? Minus 6 plus 1 is minus 5, mod whole upon 2. Minus 5 is less than 0? Yes. So it should be minus x that means minus of minus 5 which is plus 5. So 5 upon 2. Last but not the least a22. a22 
2 2 means what? It means i and j are both equal to 2. So, minus 3 into i minus 3 into 2 is minus 6 plus j is again what? Plus j means plus 2. Then you have modulus whole upon 2. What is minus 6 plus 2? Minus 4. Modulus whole upon 2. It is 4 upon 2 which is 2. How did we go about this step? Minus 4 to 4 means what? Minus 4 is less than 0. So, it becomes minus of minus. So that means minus of minus 4 is 4. So, you have all the elements now. What are the elements? Let's repeat. 1, 1, 2 is 1 by 2. A to 1 is 5 by 2. A to 2 is 2. So, how the final answer of the matrix would be there? It would be simply a matrix with the 4 elements. A11, A12 in the first row. So, that is 1 and 1 by 2 in the first row. And last but not the least row, that means the second row has A21, A22. So, that is 5 by 2 and 2. So, this is the final answer for the matrix. And in this video, we saw a matrix of the order which was asked. That is 2 by 2. So, I write 2 by 2 here, which has 2 rows and 2 columns. The rule is given to me. You just have to put the values in the given rule. And then you have to obtain the answer for the same.